San Jose is the 10th largest city in the United States and third largest in California. For San Jose, becoming a smart city is a necessity as we are faced with real challenges in our own growth. The Internet of Things is poised to transform cities in the same way that the same technology has transformed your home, from the thermostat to the light bulb. Take that at a much larger scale. We have LED street lights, we have transportation sensors, we have air quality and water quality sensors. Those take what the same benefits occur in your house and take it to the entire community. A smart city collects data from within its community. Platforms like our wireless network, we extend the reach of sensors to collect real-time data of what's going on. Sensors can include uh, air quality monitoring, traffic monitoring, people counting, gives us key business insights into how effective programs and investments for the city are doing. Transactional data is collected and analyzed to provide insights and business intelligence into how the city can plan for smart growth. The wireless network has to be robust enough to act as if it was wired while still reducing costs. And the key there is to provide maximum throughput with maximum coverage. Since many of these sensor technologies use low power Wi-Fi devices, the reach of that wireless access network has to be robust enough to bridge the gap between these consumer and prosumer type devices and what the needs of the city are. The economic benefits of our wireless network have already paid off in terms of businesses and visitors and convention goers making the decision to come to San Jose. The way we've justified the investment we've made in wireless is through the analytics we collect. We're able to identify the client experience. What was their potential throughput based on their device? What type of devices are being used? How does that influence content delivery? Which is very important in something fiercely competitive like a convention center. With the foundation that we've laid with our wireless network, we're now poised to be in a leadership position for smart city initiatives. Some of the smart city applications that pay off very quickly are putting simple sensor technology into the city's fleet and having them go about their daily activities driving throughout the city. By collecting that type of information, developing a road condition index. Another key application, especially in the United States, is looking at public transportation. What we've done with the sensor technology is taken that to a very hyper-local focus. And we're able to see differences in air quality in different parts of the city and communicate that in real time to the public. Another great smart city application is the mobile enablement of our police force. The police cars become a platform now by which they can do fingerprinting in the field, they can issue electronic citations, reduce errors, and improve the overall efficiency of the workforce. And future smart city applications include mobile offload of video from both the police car as well as the uniformed police officer with a body-mounted camera. With over 2,400 miles of roadway in San Jose, cameras deployed throughout intersections and key traffic areas provide real-time insight into both emergency response as well as traffic issues. Just think of the future where you can use wireless networks and sensors to monitor water quality at our regional wastewater facility throughout our miles of sewer systems. Smart city wireless deployments require a carrier class network that is able to deal with last mile issues like meshing of APs in an outdoor environment, being able to talk to low power devices that traditionally aren't designed to speak very loudly. The city of San Jose is extending its wireless network through the use of Hotspot 2.0 and roaming agreements with other cities like San Francisco and London. By enrolling in San Jose or any of those other cities' networks, you're able to connect seamlessly to a trusted wireless network that provides a high quality experience. Every city should start investing in smart city initiatives where platform approaches to data collection become an important part of the decision-making process. Cities around the world face similar problems, and San Jose is not unique. What's unique about San Jose is we've embraced smart technologies to help solve those problems.